So, exactly what day did this happen? Well, the 4th of August. And not to be rude or anything, can, but can I ask why you're wearing winter clothes in the middle of summer? Um, oh, you know, I just want to hide my wounds. I don't want any, like, little kids to see them and getting scared. I, I kind of just want to cover them up. Right. But I think that's all. If we need more information, we'll just give you a call. Okay, bye. Tired of this hat. I supposed you got scratched too. Yeah, there's a big gash on my on the back of my head. I don't want to go out in public like this, but I also don't want to go out in public with those winter clothes. Yeah, I feel ya. Is Juliet okay? No, I haven't heard from the hospital. Oh, I'm really worried. So am I. I'm gonna be upstairs. You know what? I'm gonna call the hospital. Tell them everything. Hello. I'm calling about... Julia Lopen. Yes, I'm her husband. Well, actually, I was calling because... Well, don't tell anyone in this, but... I am half robot, and if she can't live, she can take my body. No, I'm not joking around. I will come to the hospital and show you. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'll come and see her. Bye. Are you sure you want to give up your robot body to her? It will kill you if you do. Ma'am, I don't think you understand this, but I will do anything for her. Okay. We'll begin the process tomorrow. Hello. My name is Jason Lopen, and I need to say a few things. I'm sorry for killing people, making fun of people, and maybe even loving people, because that's all going to come to an end. Because my beloved Juliet Lopen is dying and I am giving her my body which will be very painful for me but very helpful for her I will die from doing this so that's why I'm making this video just to say everything and apologize for everything before I'm gone mom and dad if you're watching this I'm sorry for disobeying you because you two are both robots. But I'm not any ordinary robot like you would think. I have emotions and I can feel. Unlike a lot of robots, I have fallen in love and have gotten married and have had a child. But all of that has been taken away from me. First, our little beloved Lily, and then she is being taken away from me too. This is my way of saying goodbye, because I can't say it in person. I love you. I love you with all my heart, Juliet. Even though I don't have one, I still love you with all of everything that I have. And I would do anything for you. And I will do anything for you, even if it kills me. If this is Lily, all grown up, 
I love you, Lily. And I'm not just any ordinary robot. Don't think of me as a nasty robot that has done many horrible things. Think of me as someone who dreamed of being a, a real human. Think of me as someone that had a dream to be something that they couldn't be. And I never was. But I had dreams. I pretended like I was a real boy. Many people believed I was. I had many good friends. But none of them understood me like Juliet did. I'm sorry for lying. But I love you. I love you with everything I have left. I love you with everything I have left. I love you with everything I have left. I love you, Lily, with all my heart. I love you too, Mom. Because my journey is almost over. Even when you're gone, our love will last on and on. Grandma unfortunately passed away today. We are very sorry to tell you this news, but we needed to tell you it sooner or later. I miss Grandma. So do I. I want to go see her. Even when you're gone, our love will go on and on. Low battery. How are you robots? You're... You act like a human. Whoa, that's my clone. I hope you feel the same way. Those are the colors that I can change. In the morning, now see a single light upon the field. Go inside. And when she comes, I'll tell her how I feel. Five years? You haven't talked to her in five years? Just get out of my house. I never want to see you guys ever again. I just want to be alone. Jason, can you please move? I'm trying to get out. I need to do something. I can transform into a car. I love you with everything I have left. Don't forget about us. Lily lives a happy life with her husband and her two sons. But 
don't forget about us. We still have a story to tell. We love you all. Thank you for watching this series, and if you want to see more by LPS Frosting, then please like this video and subscribe. Goodbye!